guys, welcome back. I'm Julian. I'm here to do my reaction for episode 9 of season 1 of The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. This time the title of the episode is The Returned Man. And I'm excited to watch this episode uh, today if you are on Patreon. Today is kind of like a uh, finale for um, Sabrina because today I'm going to watch episode 9 and episode 10. Probably episode 11, I'm not sure, but... On his schedule is episode 9 and episode 10, which is the season finale of Sabrina. And then tomorrow, Sunday, uh, December 30th, 30, yeah, uh, we have the Christmas special. It was released on Christmas or before Christmas. So, yeah, it's going to be exciting to watch uh, these final three episodes. And I hope that you guys enjoy my reaction. I have enjoyed all my reactions because I have enjoyed this show so, so freaking much. And uh, yeah, I cannot wait to watch it. I hope that you guys, like I said, enjoyed it. Give it a little thumbs up. Uh, subscribe for more. Comment. Uh, continue supporting for more. Uh, also, go to Patreon to watch the full uncut reaction video for this episode because Netflix has been, you know, a little bit... Uh, um, not that annoying actually when you keep your reactions to 10 ish minutes uh, they don't bother you so yeah I'm trying to do that and I hope that I can be uh, I can do it in this episode as well as long as you don't have too long of a scenes I, it feels like they are okay with reactions and I'm glad because I loved sharing my reactions for this show with all of you so yeah that's it uh, without further ado, let's just begin with Season 1, Episode 9 of The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. Here we go. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Hi. what the fuck? You Sabrina? You look a lot taller than Sabrina. I'm just checking in to see how you and your dad were doing. He's back. Oh, oh! Who's back? Tommy. Dad doesn't want to. Oh my god. It's like he's not fully not back. Doc said he should rest for a bit. My brother's back. Poor thing, though. You shouldn't mess with things, Sabrina. What did you do? Okay, so the studio. He's so cute. Under the table and around everywhere. Where's she go, I wonder? Mm. We know where she's going. This style of satanic confession oh. was an option for Church of Night member. Ecstasy. He's not going to no. change you. As you know, nothing is more important to me than the birth of my twin sons. Yet more and more I worry Lady Blackwood is not the mother they'll need. What the fuck? My choir's interim director. It's everything that she ever wanted, isn't it? It worked. Tommy's back home with Harvey, who's shock, which the doctor says is totally normal. The doctor, doctor is not, doctor yeah. Second opinion. Yeah, true. I knew you shouldn't have performed that risk. Agatha, what's the matter? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. So the loophole actually didn't work, right? What's that got to do with me? We killed oh, her, my God. buried her, and brought her back to life. Yeah. The fact that Agatha is coughing up grave dirt can't. Tommy. Oh God, things are gonna go south. Hi, Dios mío, what? Tommy. What is he doing? Remember how pissed Dad was? Well, Dad is always pissed, so. Yeah. Maybe that's not Tommy. Yeah, that's you. You were an all-star, dude. Maybe there's I someone think else. Three years straight. We'd all go to your. When did you do that? Never you mind. We're fucking. <laughs> you stick to cleaning up spills on aisle five. <laughs> doing that tawdry little puppets. Shit. Nothing good is coming. You didn't feel it? I don't think so. She I was the one who caused it. I pretty much stayed in. Borrowing my book of the dead without permission. <laughs> that is exactly what she did. <laughs> Not when all you Miss Wardwell? Yeah. <laughs> I love her so much. Okay, I did a shit a thing. The wrong book. The dogs. And, and I came through into this clearing. And there were these dogs fighting over. <sighs> what? The 
dogs were tearing Tommy King Cole apart. <gasps> Roz was oh my god. Girl. Something is wrong with him. This is a mess, Sabrina. How do you find our academy then? It's Leviathan. Oh my nice. oh my god. Uh, I don't 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 I, <laughs> keep, thank it, you. keep it. Father Black, but you you honor me. He has an ulterior plan. Ah! Are exalted times for the Church of Night, Ambrosia. I don't trust him at all. He has such a beautiful smile. Oh, Luke. Thank you. Oh, yes. For making this impossible. Don't <laughs> it's Blackwood. He sees something inside you. Where is the hype? <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Doing his rounds. Oh, Sister Agatha. They're in the middle of something, by the way. But you got something. Hey, let's see. Stop <laughs> it! Excuse me. These fucking bitches! So thank you to keep your hands to yourself. She started it. Uh, yeah, sure, she bitch. Why don't you and your chum who is in lust with you, by the way? <laughs> leave my store before I start telling you. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Oh my oh, god. Okay. That sounds it. easy. Fizzy water? You serve it with love. <laughs> <laughs> well, it does seem like a solution. What was Agatha doing in the game pit in the first place? Yeah, um, Sabrina kind of killed her. Shit. So, see, there are no loopholes. Now she's gonna die either way. Tommy? Oh my god. <gasps> okay, that is not correct. That is not right. I thought he was getting better. That he was remembering. That is not right. Is she gonna see Sabrina? Ah. Any sign of Tommy? Sabrina. What was that? Uh oh. Suppose it's more close to her Ambrose. For the friends to know who called she is. Soul separation. We brought back Tommy's body, but not his soul. It's trapped it. Mm, no Ambrose is in the basement. Shit. There's something you need to see in the mommy room. Oh my god, more bad news? Beautiful voice too. Of course she does. Such a queen. Oh stop it, you're a witch! Why are you scared like that? Oh my god. Yep. Yeah. yeah. God damn it, the girls scare me more than the than that of us. To make things right. She really cares about she really cares about Sabrina. Do it then. What the hell did she do? She's that in big one, trouble. And that one Tommy hasn't eaten. Oh He's my god. Yet. Oh my god. You did everything wrong. I've got a question for Tommy you. Tommy needs to die. Why don't you tell me who dies? Hey! Oh, 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 stop! Oh my god, stop it! Oh, Tommy, no, Tommy, no, stop, no. Stop, 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 stop. Oh my god! Tommy will get better. Sabrina only cares about Harvey and whether although that's okay. Tommy's a human being as well. Pass over into mortal limbo and bring his soul back. Oh my god. I can go there. Sabrina, that's not the answer. I just need I care about what's right and about Harvey and his brother. But do you, don't you I'm care about your family? You are not capable of the magic. And you're not my mother. Zelda, so stop acting like you are. Shit. You do not speak to your Yeah. Mother, not ever. Oh God, Sabrina. It's fine. It's fine. She, she pushed it too much. She's not a child. Shit, Sabrina. Everything that she's doing right now is wrong. Sabrina, it, it, this is this is Miss Werewolf's plan, right? 
I need your help, Miss Ruby. It's not like she put you in this position, Sabrina. Oh god. It's a soul eater. Oh god damn it, Sabrina. Don't! Harvey would do it for me in a heartbeat. Actually, I don't think so, Sabrina. We all yeah, go through nice. lost. I know a threshold. Of course she does. The portal. Out of my father's side, Dorcas. Let's just get this done. What's that? <laughs> what the fuck? What's happening? What's happening? Apologies, ladies. <laughs> Nicholas! What have you done to us? I'll be waiting right here for you. I don't think so. Oh my god, what is about to happen? Was that her mom? Oh my god. Are you okay? My soul eater coming. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. My soul eater. Don't let him get you. How long is that shit? Oh my god. But we have to go. Oh. oh my. We have to run. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I knew that shit was gonna break. Are you sure? Oh my god. The soul eater's gotten him. Oh my god. What does that mean? He's dead, 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 dead. His soul is gone. You know what it means. Yeah. Who is that Miss <laughs> She's mad. I have to hope pity she is. <laughs> Performed a ritual to bring him back. <laughs> Say what now? <laughs> Sabrina, what are you talking about? I am a witch. W I T C H. I'm a witch. witch. What? What about Tom? Was killed by witches. Don't say that. Don't say that. That's not real. But it all went wrong. Terribly wrong, Sabrina. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You, you, you have to go. Why? He's taking it pretty well, yeah. though. So I can. Couldn't kill a deer. Are you telling me he's gonna be able to kill his brother? Even if he's not, it's not his brother. Bang. Oof. 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 Look at that. How could you say she's not your mom? Okay, guys, that was the end of season one, episode nine of the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. And look, I honestly, I didn't like for a minute. Uh, during the season and with everything that uh, has going on uh, during this entire nine episodes, I wasn't sure where the, the story was leading us, other than to know the players of this uh, of the game, you know, knowing the characters, uh, knowing the world, the traditions, things like that. Other than that, I thought that season one was. was was going to be really about that, you know? Uh, and, you know, what Miss Warwell was doing, it was hella confusing for me. Not that it was confusing because they didn't execute it right. No, it was confusing for me because sometimes I felt like she was really on Sabrina's side, but all the time she is working on her master plan of doing things that the Dark, dark Lord told her to do, which... What it is, it feels like he wants her to fully be a witch or to fully accept him. I still feel that there's a, a bigger motive there that I'm not really aware of. I honestly don't know. But the thing is, I feel like it was a, a great episode where, you know, a lot of things progress in terms of the story. 
Ross and Susie now know that Sabrina is a witch and that these Spellmans are witches. Which is not going to go well because they are supposed to stay hidden. And due to the things that Sabrina has been doing, uh, now they know about it. Yeah, I will say one thing is that, for instance, the, the fact that Susie now talks to her dead aunt and the aunt told her that the Spellmans are witches really is out of Sabrina's control in a way, you know? Uh, mainly because that is something that Ms. War Warwell was trying to make them do, to discover who they were and how all of their families are very much the root of, uh, of Greendale, you know? So, we have that. We have uh, uh, that discovery. Ms. Warwell is fe feeling very well because everything is going according to her plan and no one is seeing what she's doing. Uh, then you have Sabrina. Yes, I understand that witches interfere in this subject. And in a way, I think that this should have been punished. You know, Agatha and, and Dorka should have been punished for what they did to Tommy Kinkle and to the other five people who were inside of the mines, who Sabrina didn't give a shit that their family was suffering as well. She only cared about Tommy because Harvey was suffering. But here's the thing, and she always comes with the, I am only half witch, I am half uh, mortal as well. Well, the thing is that we, as morals and as humans, we lost people, you know, uh, whether if it's due to a disease or something or due to an accident where we believe it wasn't the right time for said person to go you know and uh, i believe that sabrina should if she wants to remain as a human and saying that she doesn't want to disconnect herself from her human life from her mortal life the only thing she could have done is to be there for harvey you know there are stages of grief, he will go through them, and she should have helped him if she truly cares about him. In my opinion, she should have, you know, uh, uh, stayed by, him, by his side, let him uh, go through the grief, and, you know, eventually he will have been feeling better, because that is how moral does things, you know? But no, Sabrina had this self racist thing going on where she believes that she can fool everyone that she can do whatever she wants as a witch to try to mess her witch life with her moral life you know and she's causing so much chaos and it's just insane that she's doing that uh without having any thought on anyone you know other than harvey herself you know it's very immature of her, even if she believes that she's the most mature 16-year-old girl that has ever existed. And she's not. And she's just, you know, using her um, her powers and her, her uh, spells and things like that. Yes, she is being led and she's being pushed towards, towards that. Um, by Miss Werewolf, who, you know, is not telling her you are not supposed to do this. She's just like casually dropping things and Sabrina, being the innocent young girl that she is, she doesn't know that and doesn't realize that she is playing her. But Miss Werewolf is very good at what she does uh, because she's the mother of demons, right? She, what, right? Is that who she is, right? I, I just remember that part. Um, but the thing is that she's doing like no one is really knowing what she's doing and it's it's terrifying, you know? Um, but yeah, also this episode we find out that we saw Sabrina's mom and Sabrina's mom says to Sabrina, uh, they took you from me. After the baptism, they took you from me, you know? Uh, and we hear Zelda saying that she should have left Sabrina with Diana's parents or Diana's family, but she couldn't deny the love that she has for Sabrina because she looks so much like 
Edward, even though she kind of looks a lot like the mom, but whatever. Um, thing is that she takes Sabrina, uh, and they don't let it, so there's something there, I'm, that is what I'm trying to get. There is something more there that I don't know what it is, but I'm sure that, uh, that we're gonna explore that. So next episode is the season, technically it is the season finale of Sabrina, and then we will have the Christmas special. So right now I'm going to end this, I'm gonna watch the season finale, I'm gonna enjoy it, and yeah, patrons, get ready for double Sabrina today, and I hope that you guys have enjoyed this sort of uh, Sabrina week, which has led us to the end of season one of Sabrina. Honestly, this episode was just fantastic, fan-fucking-tastic. This episode is one of my favorite episodes of Sabrina. It's just so good with so many things happening, you know, the, 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 uh, Agatha dying, even though I feel bad for her at the same time, you know, she did this, you know, but now Sabrina has killed someone, you know, and she's like, oh yeah, for a little bit, but no, like she truly did it. Uh, and on Zelda, and, and she never thinks about them, the repercussions that even though she doesn't want to be fully a witch, Zelda, Ambrose and Hilda, they do, you know, they have been living happily uh, being witches and respecting traditions and respecting things. So she should really think about her family a little bit more as well. So yeah, anyways, hope you guys have enjoyed my reaction video. Please give it a lot of thumbs up if you love the chilling adventures of Sabrina. Subscri subscribe for more, comment on the comment section down below your thoughts about this episode. Go to Patreon to watch the full uncut reaction video for this episode. And that will be it. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for the chilling adventures of Sabrina. Mwah. Bye, guys.